Okay, hey you guys. Hey, I figured I'd just do a quick little mini review. Um, it's a little late, 12:18. Uh, I've been sitting here for about three and a half hours, four hours, um, playing video games basically nonstop and all sorts of stuff. Um, I've been playing MW2, Cod Modern Warfare 2, for y'all that don't know that. Um, let me see, the one thing I have noticed is that on the boom mic, um, people tell me I'm a little quiet, so I speak up a little bit. It doesn't really adjust, to be honest with you, it just kind of goes right back to where it went. Um, I'll give you an update, maybe it's just going to take a little while to break in. On this, um, if you're using the boom mic, this little switch right here has to be on B, okay? And um, this is your mic mute switch. So if this is up like that, your mic is muted. If it's down, it's not. And if you don't have the boom mic plugged in, then you have to switch this to A to use the microphone right here. Um, what else have I noticed? Um, I don't know if I have my mix amp like hooked up wrong. But like if you look at it right now, this is all the way towards game, so I can only hear the game. But um I can still hear voices perfectly fine. So I don't know if I have it messed up or something. Um according to the directions it's fine, but it's I, I do hear a sound boost definitely with this. It sounds a lot better to me. Um not as good as I thought it would, to be honest with you. I thought they'd it'd give a little more um, you know, whatever to it, but it still sounds great, don't get me wrong. Um, tomorrow I'm going to try this out on my scan disc, um, MP3 player, it's my Sansa clip, so I'll tell you how that is. Um, and to be honest with you, these headphones are so light, I was just playing for four hours, and the only thing I can notice is the light pressure from my glasses, that's it. And I also haven't worn glasses in like eight months, so it's a little different to wear glasses. Um, the cushions are really soft. I can't even notice these are on my head. I was very skeptical about the over-the-ear factor, but to be honest with you, I'm very happy with it. Um, I used to get, like, sweaty ears or whatever from playing with the Logitech G35, but I don't get that on these. And I can barely hear them, so definitely well worth my money so far. Um, they're nice and light. The one thing I do notice that I wish they would have done see like this is like a glossy black and up here this is a flat black you really can't tell very well until you actually really look at it but I wish they would have gone with the glossy up on the headband itself um, I do have it fully extended um, just let everyone know what else here um, I'll see if there's something wrong with my mix amp or anything um, I have to send it back you know because that's just kind of weird because if I'm turning the ga the like this button right here should control my game, so if I turn this to straight game, I should only hear the game and no voices, even if they do talk. So we'll see what happens. Um, what else do I gotta say? Not much. I'm very happy with this product so far. Um, I'm gonna end up keeping this, to be honest with you. Uh, it does everything I wanted to. Because I wanted, to I was looking for a portable, high-end, gaming and portable headphones. Because I don't want to buy both pairs, so this is what I got. So works good for me. All right, guys, have a good night. Bye bye.